This following clip is of a pond that was put in by somebody else. It was my friend who lives over the hilltop from me called Andy. And this pond has been the culmination of nine to ten months of constant battling, failure and ultimately triumph. Well here we are. Sweet baby Jesus, what is this? <laughs> He's finally done it. He's managed to get it to hold water and it's got fish in. The ultimate car fish tank. And the size of them fellas in there. Some absolute monsters. They go well in any carp fishery them. And they look pretty chilled in there as well. It looks mad. Most people have a few bushes, a little bit of grass in the front garden. They might even put a pond in there, but Andy's chosen to put a car stroke fish tank in his garden. Is it not? <laughs> hey, here we go. All oh, the fish's eyes are glowing in the dark. I never thought they did that. Glowing in the dark? Aye, the, the fish's eyes were reflecting in the viewfinder here. Doesn't seem to matter. Is that the Hades look, is it? <laughs> hey, eventually. Now this project isn't the end of Andy's ideas. He has some more crazy ideas for this particular project and other ideas as well. And he's also done some pretty crazy stuff in the past as well. So please check his channel out. His channel name is... Dramatic Aquatics. No, hold on, man. <laughs> come in, come into the shot. <laughs> Hi guys. Mad Andy here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I know. What's your channel name then, Andy? Oh, the name of the channel is <laughs> Dramatic Aquatics. Stated on the bonnet here. So make sure that you check us out. Like I say, the car, it's been a challenge in itself. We started this just a short while ago, about 10 months. So it's took a little while longer than expected, but because of the winter, etc. But now we've got the tank, so now we can crack on with some cracking designs and ideas in here to make it look different on as many occasions as possible with some right good effects with LEDs, smoke, etc. Awesome. Check them out. Thanks very much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Goodbye. We'll also put a link on to the website of a local paper as well. That was the Northern Echo. They came out to do a piece. In fact, I think they were the first ones to come out before the BBC and before the Sun newspaper as well, I think. Northern Echo came out. They featured Andy on the front page of their newspaper and also on page three. But viewers will be happy to know that he was fully clothed when he was on page three. And they used loads of pictures that they took on the day that they came out. But unfortunately, it was daytime. So following this video is just going to be a few short stills of pictures that I took around about quarter past 11 one night when the car was all lit up and looking fantastic. Thanks very much for watching. Check out Andy's channel. Check out the other links in the video description. See you next time.